So here we are, guys. It is time for game number three between NSOSA's Jockji and Team Acer's Nurchio. Nurchio, who is up 2 0 at the moment, throwing out the GLHF exclamation marks. I'm sure he's pretty happy. He's got a little yeah. momentum right now. He is our Red Zerg player in the lower left hand corner of Antigua Shipyard. Yeah, he's got to be feeling pretty good going into this game. Oh, yeah. I gotta say. And his opponent here at the top right hand corner, our blue Terran player and the current reigning GSL Code S champion, is NS Hosa's Jockji. Yep. That is correct, and I like that he's chosen just regular old blue this time. I, I think yeah. it looks a little bit better on the Terran units than the than the teal does. Just like my own it. personal preference. Well, yeah, I mean, like ninety nine percent of the games that I've seen of Nurchio, he's red. So actually, uh. going into this, and I've actually seen Jockji sport blue quite a bit as well. So I just assumed that they were going to be red blue. The first game, they just wanted to throw me off a little bit though. But then they they quickly re went into the correct colors, and these are truly what do the you correct pick? colors. What color do you usually pick? Green, my favorite color. Yep. I picked that too. Ooh, we're going to play we have, some games do, later today. Do we have What's to fight to the happen? death now? I don't know. I'll just pick something else. I don't really care. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I, I I don't mind either. But yeah. usually my default is green. But uh, okay, so here we are now, and we're going to see what Nurchio has to offer in this, the third game now with him up 2 0. Is he going to try something to catch his opponent off guard one more time? Looks like a little more conventional barracks than gas uh, coming out now for Jock G. Yep, think we're going to see that reactor at Hellions again, almost certainly. And mm -hmm. uh, 15 hatch going up for, uh, oh, actually 14 hatch from. Mm -hmm. Nurchio, did I see that right? Yeah, yeah, you're right. Did go 14 hatch. Okay. Basically built the drone and the hatch rate about the same time. So oh, yeah. Interesting. All right. So um, and so basically the same as a 15 hatch. Oh, pretty much the same. Um, but uh, I I I wish we could go back and look to say because I was just assuming you went well, 15. I actually and then just I, I actually just checked the 14, time. So it was 14 by about three seconds. So. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Well, not. Not a huge deal either way, but kind of interesting to note, I guess. Most Zerg players do like to get that hatchery on 15. And Nurchio, aw, poor drone is trapped, and he knows he's like, I'm going to he die here. On a suicide mission. <laughs> That's All right. right. <laughs> well, we'll see what that drone can make of his life. It's Looks like need he's. going to be Hogan's Heroes drone to get out of this one. <laughs> do, 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 do. That's 18, do. dude. I know. Oh, okay. I was. Oh, anyway. Um, I was hoping he was going to sport something pretty cool there, trying to make a, a great escape, so to speak. We'll see. He's oh. probably going to come back and just try and deny a little bit more mining as this. Nope. I don't want to die. I just want to become a building. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. And uh, let's see here. As the barracks gets thrown down, we'll see a fact. I'm sorry. We'll see a reactor here in just a second. For yeah, that drone did see the factory too, I believe. Yes, it did. Yeah. So he knows. Oh, and getting the fast roach warrant for Nurchio. I think we're going to see that fast uh, seven or eight roaches that we see. Players like Stefano do quite a bit. Oh, pretty much all Zerg players are incorporating it into their play right now. Yep. And uh, Antigua Shipyards is a great map for doing this because it's so small. The rush distance is uh, really, really quick for those roaches to get across there. And if your opponent does react out a couple aliens and you make like eight roaches, well, guess what? You're actually probably just going to kill them. Jachi looks like he was trying to catch an overlord there. Um, yes, he was moving to the top left-hand corner. Unfortunately, nothing there, and uh, the bet doesn't pay off. That overlord was just a little bit farther north than that. Yep, he knows his timings. He is a, a top Terran player. Yes, and he is. And it's always good to be just active with those Marines out around the map, too. All right, well, let's see what these Zerglings are going to be able to do is they'll They'll see the expansion timing and try and chase down that SUV. Good control by Nurchio uh. to bring one Zergling around the outside. This SUV trying to, well, initially was trying to retreat back to a couple of Marines, but... And oh, nice job. And, oh, oh I thought he was going to keep it alive. Down. That yep. is annoying. Okay. Oh. Well, there you go. Bunch of Roaches coming up, as you mentioned. Already five on the field with two more, so there's your seven Roach push you were talking about. Yep, and uh, he's going to meet the Hellions coming right across here, and we'll see if uh, Jockji responds by starting to make Marauders right away. That's usually what you see. Yep, there's a Marauder. He cancels the Marine and goes right into the Marauder. And if he puts up a bunker right now, he should be perfectly fine against this. Um, oh, the bunker's not going to get there quite in time, I guess, in this case. Yeah. But some players like to start it. He's going to go without the bunker. All right, he's going to rely on his control at the moment to make the most of this defense. Yep. That command center could actually be delayed once again by a pretty good period of time if that SCV gets picked off, and it looks like it will. So Ouch. alone, that has done quite a bit of damage. Yep, there's a Marauder, and uh, Nurgio will need to pull back a little bit here, group up, 
And is he going to have enough nice micro pulling that one roach back that was injured, pulling two roaches back? He's doing such a great job, job uh, keeping these roaches alive. Oh, and if he gets that Marauder, that's going to be pretty helpful because that's oh, the only one there. Oh, my God. He is pushing uh -oh. through once again. This is getting bad for Jokji. Looks like oh, one wow. Marauder left, two roaches. They're going to try and chase him around all day long. Yeah. And um, But, yeah, I mean, that command center was delayed once again for a long period of time. Damage done to that frontline army. Not a lot left on the field for Jokji at the moment. So this push has done pretty well. Yep, looks like he'll be okay, though. I mean, with the Marauder and the two Hellions out, that won't be any problem at all. Right. Um, yeah, usually when a Terran dies to this, is if it's if they don't make Marauders. You know, if they just sure. don't see it coming or something like that, you know, or they don't make the tech lab on the barracks, which does happen soon. But Jokji, uh, quite ready for everything. And a fast third from Nurcio. Yep, does allow him to safely expand, or so he feels. He's also putting up three more gas at the same time. So with layer tech, we're going to see some tech here in just a bit. Mm-hmm. All so, right. We'll have to kind of wait and see what the players transition out of at this point. Two more gases going up for Nurcio. He could go into that Infester style that he's been preferring here, but this is also a really good map for Mutaling as well. Yeah. Uh, a lot of reactors going up right now for uh, Jokji. Uh, getting that Starport as well. I'm yes. I'm kind of curious. Well, okay. Let's, let's see here. Let's see if he makes a switch in just a second as well. Reactor powering almost. This is close to that reactor powering build. We'll see what comes out of this factory if he lifts off and changes this onto a uh, tech lab or something along those lines. Yep. It's like this poor overlord is going to die in the middle of the map. Bye-bye. We do have a Spire starter for Nurcio as well. Yeah, he could just be going Marine Marauder, Hellion, Medivac. That's also something that Terran players have been doing lately. Yeah, there's the Medivac. Oh, he actually canceled it. Okay. Let's canceled see. it. There's the switch. And okay. Swapped. Yep. He's going to want to react to those Medivacs out, I guess. Yeah, and I'm sure this factory is going to get a tech lab here in a second. And where does he have... Okay, there's the tech lab barracks. It was just kind of buried <laughs> back there, the little tech lab just trying wow. to hide. I was like, I see combat shields. I don't see a tech That's lab. That's actually amazing that that fits back there. Yeah. The huh. more you know. I didn't know that. All right. Okay. Cool little building positioning thing from Jokji. Cool, cool. All right. So let's see here now. What is Nurcio moving into gas five and six? So he is serious about his airplay. Already has 600 gas saved up at the moment and is only sitting on 49 drones right now, which actually isn't all that much in the grand scheme of things for this and time. Is also only sitting on four roaches right now, which is not going to be too great for holding off this push no. that's coming across the map. He's going to need to make some more units. There he goes making some more lings. Spire is about done, but he does not have enough minerals to make a lot of mutas at once. Yeah, exactly. I was about to say, he was continuing with his gas production, and he just needs minerals at the moment, especially committing yeah. over to so many Zerglings. Yeah, went a little bit overboard on the gas for a second. Yep. And if Jokchi pushes right now, he could do some damage. Well, we'll find out if he's going to. Those four roaches are sitting on the high ground. Some creeps spilled out as well. Oh, not a great engagement for Nurcio. Oh, uh -oh. Gets a lot of his units killed right away, and now with Stim and those medevacs, those lings are just going to melt. Yeah, they certainly will. Stim Marines under medevacs are pretty good, I've heard. Oh, he's oh. taking out a lot of drones, too. This game not going quite as well for Nurcio. The Baneling Nest just started here. GG, there it is. 